what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Chris ZT and I'm finally bringing you guys the long awaited dribble tutorial and without further ado we're gonna get to the first step of this video. Now I want to show you guys my animations and what I'm rocking with and basically if you want to dribble like this use these animations and I got you guys man. I'm gonna try and do my best to teach you guys how to dribble in this game. Let me move this controller out the way so you guys can see everything. So my dribble style is power. My moving crossover is pro eight. My moving behind the back is pro three. Moving spin, this is very important. Basic one. My moving hezzy is pro four. My sig size up is Chris Paul. I don't have a park size up. My basic size up package is pro five. And my size up escape package is pro five. I don't use any triple threat styles. It's just normal one. I believe the size up escape is what changes your behind the back. It's one of these two. So if you want to change your behind the back, that's how you change it. And without further ado, let's get actually into the tutorial. I'll see you guys there. All right. So this looks familiar, doesn't it? So basically what we're going to do here is you guys see the controller on the top left. What I'm going to do is tell you guys how to do the move and then I'm going to actually recreate it and you will see how I do it with the controller. You guys can see I'm moving my stick. So basically without further ado, let's get into the first move. This is the crossover basically. This is the easiest thing to do in the game. You just hold R2 and then do a crossover. This is the momentum cross. One of the easiest things to do in this game. Now, a lot of people have been asking me, how in the world do you quick stop off of anything? So basically, you run one way, tap L2, shoot straight out of it, and then boom. That is how you quick stop. A lot of people also ask me how you prevent park size ups. Well, most people that quick stop also hold r2 and i do not as you guys see on the controller i'm going to demonstrate one more time when i quick stop i do not press anything nothing except square i always see i shot too fast but you guys get the gist of it all right so this dribble move is called the curry slide this was very popular in nba 2k20 you guys probably have used this move right here it is this one right here all you need to do this year literally is hold your right stick and then flick it diagonal opposite to the ball hand. Look at what I'm doing on my controller. That is all you need to do. You could spam it that way. It is a great move. It is wonderful. All right, so now let's move on to the behind the back. Obviously, this is back. It was in 2K20. This year, it's kind of the similar thing. You kind of just flick your right stick diagonal and then move towards the ball hand with R2. You could spam it as long as you want. Just look how I'm doing it on the controller right there keep spamming it and boom all right now this is a move that i was asked a lot on how i do it so basically you do this move and you do through the legs and then you cancel it out with the same dribble move so basically if the ball is in your right hand you want to flick the stick diagonal opposite of the ball hand to do a behind the back and then cancel it instantly with flicking it right back to the same ball hand i'm going to demonstrate on the left side this time Flip the diagonal and then press it left. Obviously, I didn't do it there because I suck. But flick a diagonal and then flick the right stick towards the right if the ball is in your right hand. And it will give you that little through the legs. It is nice coming up the court. Trust me, I use it a lot. You will probably see it in my videos. And you can shoot out of it, obviously, with L2. All right, I wanted to demonstrate off of the curry slide. As you guys see, I taught you guys the curry slide. Do that. And a lot of people, if you try to shoot out of it, it will give you that. Now I want to show you guys how to prevent that. This is how you prevent it. You just do the curry slide, tap L2 as it's going, and then you could shoot straight out of it. It is as simple as that. All right, now this move is a killer. It's an absolute killer. It works running up the court. So basically, you run up the court, you let go of everything, spin the right stick, and hold the left stick backwards. So basically, let me do that again. You run forward, spin the right stick, hold the left stick backwards. It will give you the quick one most of the time. Sometimes it will give you that one. But if it gives you that one, you can shoot straight out of it. You don't need to press L2 or anything. All right, there's another dribble move that is similar to the curry slide. You basically just do a crossover, but you hold it instead of doing the normal cross, which would obviously be that. But instead, you hold it and you get this crossover right here. It's a long one. It's from 2K16, if you guys remember from that. And the same way to shoot out of it is just tapping L2 and you can shoot out of it and boom, green. All right, we're going to move on to something a little bit more advanced, but fear not, it will be explained very easily. So basically, you do a momentum cross and do a behind the back. You have to do it fast, though, and then you get that animation. Very nice. Works with a screen, works on ISO, and then you just tap L2 to quick stop. Let me demonstrate one more time. So basically, you do a momentum cross behind the back, L2 to quick stop, boom. You shoot straight out of it. Wonderful move. I love using it. 
All right, so this is a new move in NBA 2K20. It's basically a full spin. So if you're running left, what you want to do is twirl your right stick away from the ball as you're running left still. So basically, if you're running left, twirl your right stick to the right. If you are running right, twirl it left. You want to keep running to the same direction as I do it on the controller right there. And boom, you get that full spin. There's a little bit of a combo you can do with it. I want to show you guys right now. You do the spin, press down on the right stick, press L2 to quick stop, and boom wonderful move it gets you open in the corner i'm gonna start using it because i have it and i found it on in the demo i recommend you guys use it right so basically that's all the dribble moves in this game that i do right now obviously i can make an updated one but this is just the first few days what gets me open i do have about a 96 win percentage right now so i do get open i average like 16 points per game in the park so like i said i do get open i hope you guys enjoy this video if you are having struggles still i could make a part two and try to explain it better but i think i explained it the best i can obviously the controller on the screen will probably help a lot i hope you guys enjoy this video i seriously love you guys man and i'm gonna show you guys a little bit of highlights of me actually doing some of the dribble moves so you guys can stay around for that or you can just stop the video right here i love you guys man have a great day peace out everyone's an inside there's no point on a bp build being hollywood, hollywood. what waking up and no, wake up early with the stream early ah! oh, Iggy, I, Iggy, I was going to right but then i do you guys believe chat no. Have you had this, uh, the thing happen? No. Oh my god. Hey Ben, what's up, dude? Is that Ben Graham? Can we stop these lobs? There's a fucking blush Jalen throwing lobs. Like, he's not even dribbling. Like, he's literally going, like, setting himself down the paint, throwing a lob. You guys playing Jalen? Just kind of just. What's the blue court? The pretty Burfredo court? <laughs> that was actually the funniest thing I've seen in my entire life. <laughs> Shot. Fucking go. Hey, too early. I shouldn't have done that in like a clutch moment. I just should have waited for the game to end. Nope. My player just slid all the way out of the way. Thank God. I'm not trying it. Cause then I have to turn meter on, and I'm not turning meter on. Wow. There's no way that's hungry. There's one there. Tio's tweet? What's Tio's tweet? <laughs>